この番組はご覧のスポンサーの提供でお送りしました。Okay, that's our cover image. I look stupid. Yeah, so do I. Hello, and welcome to our first snack unboxing because our hurricane's coming and we're hungry. So, this is burrito mask.、Uh, it turns out that we are married. We bought ourselves some Tokyo treat. I know it's August, but we already got our September box. Don't ask me why, but that's a thing. We bought the most expensive one, which brings the soda.、Um, they have other、um, packages. So, we're gonna eat Japanese snacks and we're gonna tell you what we think. I am what I believe to be a connoisseur of Japanese snacks. And this is not my first time buying this, it's just our first time sharing it with you.、Um, so, Oh, you are the. What was that? This is big. Japan. Ah. Oh, you want me to read it? Yes, I was waiting for you to read it、But、this whole time. You're the one with the best accents. What do you want me to read this shit? You're gonna have to put some title on. <laughs> <laughs> It's not that bad. It's a potato chip. Enjoy the savory eel. Salty eel. roasted seaweed and sweet soy sauce flavoring these tasty, crunchy, and uniquely Japanese chips. <sighs> All right, let's、uh, feast. I mean, I like eel, but I don't think I want it in a, like, a salty snack. Wait, is this one eel or the b o t Yeah, look, it's eel. Munakata Konger. Huh? Which is eel? Okay. Is that French? Yes.、Mm, it smells like eel. <laughs> I don't taste the eel that much. It tastes more like eel sauce than eel. Like the eel sauce you literally get at a sushi restaurant. You got a good potato taste, though. It's like light. It's kind of like、um, ruffles. It tastes like ruffles potato chips, but with eel sauce on it. It's not bad. What's this? Ah. Hmm. Nostalgic sauce, senbei. Okay. Oh, it's to make your own senbei. Add the special sauce. What's a senbei? I guess it's a business. Huh? It's nostalgic. For who? For Japanese people. Oh. I think I've had this before.、Mm. Why has it got a little otter on it? And, like, look at this cookie. It's like the thinnest. Isn't this like what they eat in church? La hostia. La hostia. Do you want to put the otter sauce on it? Do you need to pray before? <laughs> Espiritu Santi. <laughs> Aww. He's cute. It smells like vinegar. Hmm. <laughs> I don't want it anymore. I think I put too much. <laughs> Eye patch boy. What is senbei? It kept saying senbei. It has an otter on the sauce. It's like ketchup without the tomato、It's、sauce. A special sauce. It just says nostalgic sauce. It's actually really good. I like it. What do I know this guy? Cabbage taro this. Cabbage? Hello, cabbage. It looks like a, like a, a cock frog. This saucy snack is a favorite flip. No, my favorite. It's this one. This is the camera. Look at my cabbage. It's gonna be in the worst definition. Bite size, <laughs> shape, and savory flavor make it the perfect light snack. Yeah, okay, let's just eat it. Ooh, it looks like a tater tot. Feels like a puffy Cheeto. The best kind. But it tastes like. Vegetable soup. It's like what you give your kids when you don't want to give them sugar. It's like ahiyako. Tastes like deception. Noir. Noir with this. Black cocoa sticks. I'm fine with that. So, this is one of the premium items it's brown sugar syrup and kineko cocoa sticks. So, this one, we got the cocoa, I guess. <laughs> I like that this lady on the box is like, yummy.、Mm. It looks like Pocky,、uh... but the other one. The one that they sell at Ross in the checkout aisle?、Mm -hmm. Who went, went back in time to create this tasty cocoa? Who went、tree? black in time? Went back in time.、Oh. <laughs> I transported to old Japan when you try these treats. Can I get transported to old Japan? Like, suddenly I'm in like Ghost of Tsushima. <laughs> My house is on fire. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it wants to be an Oreo. I like it though. I do too. I think it's, it's very basic. The flavor kind of like sits on the back of your tongue and it's kind of brownie ish. Brownie like. It doesn't taste like an Oreo. It tastes like an Oreo if 
the cream had like a hint of coffee. Ah. Uh, you can taste coffee? A little bit. Are you transported to old Japan? I'm That's supposed to be a ninja now. Stop, we have to eat more. That's what I'm trying to do. We must stay for the hurricane. Oh, we got oh. bear balls. Bear balls! Oh, it's the Satan bear! It's the Hail Satan bear! Those are supposed to be sparrow egg peanuts. These little egg-shaped peanuts have a crunchy, sweet, and spicy soy sauce flavored coating. Spicy. Always, always. The retro packaging is also super cute, bringing back to Japan of yesterday. But the packaging is different from the. Oh wait, is it the same thing? Is the theme this month time travel? And look, the I'm thing, not really the, against it. The theme looks it. different from the the. the hey, wait a minute! That's a different picture. But the the item looks the same though. All right, bottoms up. Hail Satan. Ooh! Crunchy, baby. That was a big crunch. It like smashed up in my mouth. I don't want another one. This looks like like those hundred year old eggs with like the veins inside and like the dead baby chip. Oh, this is like, this is not appealing. It didn't even taste that bad. It just looks like shit. I don't want more. It just tastes like crunchy and peanuts, you know? I can barely feel the, the soy sauce at the beginning. It really does. It tastes like a peanut and you put soy sauce on it. And it's on like uh but the texture is very odd. Cookies. All right. Oh, we got some angry Japanese men. Oh, I love this. I'm an angry Japanese man. Japanese sweet selection. Boba madness is still strong in Japan. It is. It really is. It was last year when we went. And we're bringing a piece of the craze to you this summer. Oh, you too kind. Is this what we look like in the video? Comment yes or no if I look like the lady on the left and he looks like the dude on the right. I wish. I wish. Look, he's got Mount <laughs> Fuji on it and Tokyo Tower and the little wave. And look at look at his hands. Look, he's holding the snacks. Oh. <laughs> I want to do that. I'm going to open that. I'm going to do that with my hands. Oh. Do, 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 do. It's just a bunch of little cubes. So are we supposed to uh, eat it or put something? I'm not sure. I know that's that sticky sweet snack, and that looks like mochi with a boba inside. Oh, look, it's even got little people on it. Hold on, because I promised. Your boba is nothing compared to mine. Uh, <laughs> greetings. I come in peace. Joe, Joe. Do, 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 do. All right, I guess you try both, and I'll try both. So we try both, huh? Why'd you say to put it over ice and shit? It's the yellow one. This is like chocolate. Ooh, mine like ooze. It has some kind of ooze inside. It's pretty good. It's pretty sweet. Chewy texture inside. But it has I like a boba, boba on it. Chewy some boba inside? Like that. You ate two of it? How do you have room to try all this shit? I am a Japanese man. Pink one doesn't have brown underneath. Oh, so some chocolate up. and a gummy inside. Yep. A gummy. Because it's supposed to simulate those Japanese snacks there on the wrapper. It kind of really does taste like it though. It has the texture of whatever that thing is called. Ah, no, I don't like it. Oh man, leave it to me. I love it. It has a caramel flavor. The outside's white chocolate. And the inside has a chewy caramel flavored gummy. It's straight fire. Straight fire. Umaibo. Umaibo. Nori. Oh. It's nori seaweed. A connoisseur of Japanese snacks. Umaibo seaweed salt flavor. Umaibo took five years carefully selecting the new flavor before launching this seaweed salt snack. I mean, yes. don't they have like a hundred flavors? Feels like they have a hundred flavors. You know they have a cheese flavor? What was it? Reckless? Oh, uh, come on, bear. Camembert flavor. Oh my camembert. god. Camembert. We had a pork one after we had the camembert oh, one. pork one was beautiful. So this is Umaibo. Imagine a really big Cheeto with a hole in it. Same texture as Cheetos Puffs. <laughs> oh, I'm not against it. I'm not for it though. Yeah, it's mad, you know. You get some seaweed taste. It doesn't even taste like the seaweed you buy as a snack at the store in the little strips. It tastes like the seaweed on, on sushi. Yeah, yeah, it does taste like this. Yeah. If you really like that stuff, go ahead and be my guest, but I'm not for you. 
Shaved ice jelly. These shaved ice jellies taste of one of most popular treats in all Japan. I guess the theme is all Japan. Does it say what the fucking theme is? Treats. Oh my oh. god. Time travel treats. It's almost like we should have mentioned this at the beginning. This whole time I was wondering, why is everything so old? Oh, try freezing it. Fuck. Did you open it? Barely. All right, try freezing it. Let's try, there's only one. So I mentioned earlier, if you buy like the, Evangelion! I know. Oh, if you buy the $30 one, you always get a drink. And today I got an Evangelion drink. This is going in the collection. So the reason that we have this and we're not going to drink the Evangelion drink is because this was in the fridge. This is orange vanilla Coke. This is not from this box of Tokyo Treat, but it is from the last one. So I'm leaving it in this video. Isn't this the one that's only available in Japan? I have no idea. But it has to be. <laughs> Do you like orange vanilla? Flavor? It kind of exploded. I like vanilla. I've never had orange Coke. It tastes like orange sherbet. Like an ice cream. Like a, not necessarily a cream soda, but it's not my favorite. It's like not carbonated enough. And that might just be because it this, ships this from Japan. This would work better as a, as a frozen treat. Yeah, I don't so like flat it's... soda. Secretly, we've been getting snack boxes from different companies. We got one where the soda was not, it did not lose carbonation. So I don't think it was just because it came. I think that soda just doesn't have good carbonation. It was ramune. The other one was ramune and the other one was in a glass container. So I don't know if the Coke being in a plastic container made it be less flat or it's just less flat. I don't want to outwardly just say, it's flat, I don't like it. Um, because it might have happened in shipping. I don't think it happened in shipping though. But it's light and we don't like it. Yeah, we don't like it. <sighs> Mochen Dongo. Mochi is the ultimate traditional Japanese treat. This three piece set of chewy, cute, and color from Mochi will have you feeling old Japan vibes in no time. You know, I get it. The copywriters trying their best to make each one of these different. They have to write a different one every month about probably snacks that repeat over and over again. But this angle about like taking you back in time I think if I was a Japanese person, I would probably agree. But as a non-Japanese person who didn't grow up with this stuff, I'm just like, it's snack. It food. It good. Oh, it was? Oh yeah, it's tasty mochi. <clears throat> What's it taste like? It just like tastes like mochi and there's some uh, coating of fine powder sugar. And it's just basic mochi taste. Mine was like strawberry, I think. I just ate the white one. I think it's just sugar. You want to split the green one? Let's split the green one. Ooh, I like that one. That was a lot better. Ooh, I can have more. People watching this video going, oh my God, these married people are so gross. I really wanted to know what this was because it's a big ass box. It has Pokemon on it. Pokemon Ototo Crackers. Ototo Crackies by Morinaga. Is this Mojo Jojo? I don't know this Pokemon. It's Does he have a number on his head? Is he like an experiment? It's Mojomon. Why is Celebi pink? Is there something of Pokemon, like a movie or something? coming out. I I'm really sure. enjoy this little guy. He's like a little whale. I guess he's the mascot. He's really cute. <gasps> they come in different shapes. Oh my God. Pikachu is here for an adventure with this tasty consomme cracker. Consomme. Oh, it's okay. soup. Oh, so it's, wait a minute. Is it Ahiako <laughs> again? Oh, they're individually wrapped. Oh, and there's, it's trying to tell me something. Did I just win the lottery or something? The wait is more. What is, what, is, what is going on? There's like all these words and, is this to like order more? You never see this in like American it's stuff. It's weird things. Is it? This is very Japanese. Kore wa nan desu ka? Ah, this one looks like a sword, but I think it's a uh, eggplant. It's not and a whale? Look, look. What is this flavor? Let's have a little sword fight. I will defeat you. You're a little too forceful. I will defeat. Fuck. Fuck. Yeah. It tastes like um, goldfish. It tastes like no flavor. It's a bit salty. There's a bit of uh, veggie taste in the background, but. It tastes like the snack that smiles back. Goldfish. Goldfish ah. is like something like your friend gets in their lunchbox and you're like, oh, I kind of wish I had that. And then you're like, Nah, my mom got me pudding, and pudding's better than goldfish. This is definitely not a real story. I, this is not something that definitely actually happened to me. I wish I knew what that was. This There's supposed to be like a Pikachu and other Pokemon. There's like a carrot. It looks like a squid. Maybe edamame? What Pokemon is this? What's that Pokemon? 
Is that a Pokemon? It's I, Pikachu. That, oh, is that the, the weird... Uh, it's like a chubby Pikachu. Hold on, the box will tell us. Pikachu. Chubachu. It looks like... I guess this one is supposed to be Pikachu. Oh, that guy. Oh, I, I don't remember his name, but he's in the new game and I couldn't get him and it was making me very upset because he was so cute. No, I have eaten him. That really wasn't that bad. It wasn't that good. It tastes just like goldfish. It's good enough to snack on. Uh, what is that? Is that rice? Soba meshi. Saucy soba snacks. Saucy soba snacks. Oh. Saucy soba snacks. It's noodles. Oh, is it like that other thing we had? Uh, I think so. This is going right. to be really this hard to eat. This supposed to be sweet. Savory and sweet sauce flavor will have you drooling because it gives you rabies. Well, the rabies crunch. is horrifying. I saw a video of a kid with rabies the other day. It was awful. Those are the right. things I Google in my free time. You just kind of have to shove it in your mouth, I guess. It looks like popped rice. It looks like big blackheads, you know? Oh, like the... <laughs> yeah, when you pop them. <laughs> <laughs> it mm. does. Oh, you know baby teeth. Wow, that's a lot of flavor. I ate one and it had a lot of flavor. I like this. It's soy sauce flavor. It says soba, but it tastes like soy sauce. No, no, I taste the, the soba. Yeah. Oh yeah, it does taste like, you know what? I like it a lot. This thing, super weird, but I like it. Yeah, I like it. All right, it's not too bad. What is that mascot though? Like, I don't know what it is. Is he a funnel? It's not as sweet. A whoopee cushion? <laughs> Ooh. Cola ball. Ooh, that's it, that's all it is. That's the premium. If I saw this in a convenience store, I would never, never know it was a snack. You gonna pop it? Of course. Pop? What do you mean pop it? No, it like says open me. <laughs> it has a proper like, way of opening. It's like a giant pimple. W wait, what's it say? It's a cola ball. Jelly. It's cola jelly. It's just very basic cola jelly. It <laughs> says, we'll have you talking a walk down memory lane. I get the fuck out of here. I can't take a walk down memory lane. I don't have I don't have memories of this. Ooh, it's wet. It's wet, y'all. It's like those, you know those lychee gummies that they sell in like absurd quantities, like 200 at a time. Oh. I think we need a spoon. I think that's a no for me, dog. You don't want it? No. I'll eat the whole thing. Eat the whole thing, yeah. yeah. This looks right up my alley. Mmm. Tell me. It tastes just like a lychee gummy, same texture, really wet. It kind of slides through your mouth, mm. and it tastes like Coke. That's your fault. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Don't like slimy textures, you will be 100% absolutely disgusted. But I love slimy textures. So do I on this one. Lucky Cat Candy. Oh, my hand is sticky. Inside this cute and retro design on the packet, you'll find a cool candy. As you enjoy it, it changed color from red to yellow to green. Groovy! It's gonna change? It's gonna change color, but you're not gonna see it because it's in your mouth. Am I supposed to take it out of my mouth? Yeah, it's too gross, I guess. You gonna show your people? Yeah, it even, it even tells you like, the color is going to change. Okay. Am I supposed to go down memory lane again? <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm like shitting on this like one person who's just trying to do their job. I mean, they, you know, I get they're, it. Trying, they're trying to get new ideas. So it starts off like a purpley red. Is it like a, like a jawbreaker? It doesn't say anything about it. It just say groovy. <laughs> <laughs> guess fuck me, right? We're married. You could just uh, eat it. I'll like, just put it in your mouth. Yeah, I right, could. What color is it? Purple. Yeah, yeah, it's purple and it's disgusting. I gotta wait for it to change color. Oh, I guess I'm eating. You the can next teach one. us about the next one while I. All right, this one is gonna be easy. It's a rice mm -hmm. crispy bar. Mm. Oh, I thought it was. Bon. It's still purple. Don come bar. Using domestically grown rice, this crunchy and puffy rice treat has a sweet and spicy flavor from the soy sauce drop soy sauce again. <laughs> that is popular traditional flavoring. It's like this is all soy sauce. All soy sauce. The last Japan treat had these. This is the most delicious gummy I've ever had in my life. Everything was 10 out of 10. I don't like this theme. What color did it hit? He's getting lighter. Mmm. Mm. I don't want to eat this anymore. What's that taste like? It tastes like rice with flavor. It's a little bit sweet. I don't feel any soy. What is supposed to be soy in it? Yes, there's supposed to be soy in it. I don't want it anymore. You're not going to try this, right? I mean, I want to try it. Yeah, you can try it. I just spit it out. It's still warm. Yeah, that's uh, disgusting. I guess that's someone's fetish. This tastes like sweet soy sauce. Like if you mix soy sauce and honey. I actually kind of like it. 
It tastes like a gyudon on rice. Gyudon. Did you chew it? Yes. You're supposed to suck on it and change the colors. Ramune, because there's always a Ramune in the box. Translation, ¿Qué es esto? If it's from Japan, there is Ramune. Ramune is one of the most timeless Japanese soda. Looks like there's drugs in there, like Tom's. Easy and crunchy Ramune candy treat is one that will be enjoyed for many years to come, but can enjoy it all right now. Finally, something I don't have a short time travel for. Oh, it's a little, oh. Is that? Pills! Get addicted to drugs! I don't like the Ramune pills. Wait, you've already had this? Yeah, we had this before, remember? No. Like, we, had, uh, we had this. No, we had like Ramune high chews. Uh, oh. just, just dissolves in your mouth. like. Ooh! Okay, so this thing did not stay solid in my mouth. It just turned into liquid. Tasty liquid. I liked it. But it was very strange. I want another one. You want it with water? Yeah. No, no. With water, you don't taste it at all. Oh. But it does kind of fizz and bubble. Mmm. Drugs. <laughs> I like it. Next! Next, you mean the last one? No, we have... Oh, that is the last one. There's not a lot of things in this box. You're comparing it to Munch Yum or whatever? Munch box. Munch, munch pack. Box. Munch pack is all Munch pack. Like, oh my god. Let's get the box. There's lots of different snack boxes you can get from. There's some that are international, there's some that are domestic, there's some that are healthy, most of them are not. This one, instead of being just from one country, is, is a bunch of countries, all all of them. And it's huge. It's, this one is it's biggest. like perfectly square. And it, it's, it's just filled with so many things. That one. It was very good. I know you're complaining that this one is like too small, but that one is overwhelming. We ate it in one night. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't recommend that. I wouldn't do that again. We were supposed um, to, to make a video about it. And then we didn't. We were like, I just want to eat this. I don't want to pull out the camera and the light kit and the other camera. Like, I'm good. Thanks. Oh, it's Kit Kats. Okay. It's Ocean salt. Uh, Are they salty? No, it's fish sperm. That's, that's what they mean by ocean salt. <laughs> Ew, it, even the way that it's worded is weird, so it's just bear fish with me. Jizz, baby. Kit Kat are finding ways to improve the future through snacks. Japanese sea salt is worked into the cream and then sandwiched between wafers and wrapped in white chocolate. And for every bag sold, Kit Kat will donate 10 yen to Zero Waste Japan Activity. I don't know about you, but Japanese Kit Kats are kind of not my thing. I like that the container is made out of paper, by the way. It's not plastic. Oh, but this is plastic. Mine has a polar bear on it. Hi, little buddy. What's yours? It's a shark. <gasps> I guess they are all different. Okay, hold on. So we have killer whale, dolphin, big whale, walrus, and then like, <laughs> I guess no one wants to get this one, right? <laughs> I'll eat this one. Pretty good. No. Yeah, it's like white chocolate and just a, a little hint of salt. I'm just not on board I mean, with fish it. Jizz. Fish jizz. Fish don't have jizz. That's what they make you believe. Because <laughs> don't think about fish fucking and it'll be better. If there's something I really think is weird, it's white chocolate with salt. There's snacks that are good with salt, like caramel, but hot, but white no, chocolate? White chocolate work with salt, really. I mean, someone must agree with you because they all made the, this. All the chocolate work with salt, really, you know? Sweet and, uh, and salty is very basic. But this one is very good. It is very, very good, very tasty. And this is the September box, even though it's like August 1st. It's August! Oh, it's already August. Shit. Anyway, one of these days, I'm gonna win this. You're always entered for a raffle to win like a big crate. Despite the fact that I didn't like most of the items in this, I wouldn't say don't try it out. You know? It yeah. was just this box. And like, the stuff that was good was good. We're getting Boksu next which is another Japanese one. And let me know if you like this video because uh, we got lots of boxes to unbox and you never get to see burrito masks. So congratulations, your face is on the internet. 
The only thing we didn't show was the Evangelion drink, but I would really actually have that cold. Unless, okay, hold on. Let me see if this tells me not to have it cold and it's supposed to actually be hot because I can't read Japanese. It literally just says it's creamy and rich and in a can. Yeah. Creamy, rich, and in a can. I feel that and that's always what they use for those things. This one is creamy, this one is creamy, what you know, else this is, is creamy really, here? This is really haunting me. It's haunting me because it's like, oh, you know, to celebrate their upcoming movie. I have been waiting like seven years for this movie of right. Evangelion to come out. How long? No, more than that. When was the last one out? I think this one was in production when the tsunami happened. It's been, it's been 86 years. And all I want is the Evangelion movie. I don't even care about the Sailor Moon movie that much. It doesn't look that good. But Evangelion? Oh my god. You can't see. But I have a bunch of Ev Evangelion figures above my head. Evangelion is life. It's so good. I know I'm Sailor Tortilla, but I really should have just been like, Ava Tortilla. Look at my buddy. He's a baby. He's a big boy. Big girl. He's looking at it suspiciously. Oh, it's a little cold though. It, it did actually kind of get cold while I was in the fridge. I like that Shinji's holding what I'm holding. It's really hard to identify with Shinji. So now that he's holding it and I'm holding it, I feel like right now for this moment, I am Shinji. And that's the only time I'll ever feel like I am Shinji. Video's over, we're done. Bye. I'm gonna go edit this now. Yay. I am Sailor Tortilla. And this is motherfucking burrito mask, I swear to God. <laughs> this is the outro and you're just not doing your part. I don't know what it's supposed to say. I am burrito mask. But I am Caramba. not. I am a Japanese man. We got another box coming in two days. So let me know so I can <laughs> leave the camera set up where it is. Thanks. Bye. Bye.